Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I've got a confession to make. This happened again. I don't quite know how it happened but it's happened again. I've been shopping, got a massive haul and I just can't help myself. <laughs> So, the first thing that I got was this. It is a Jim Vinci inspired Rottweiler clutch. I got it from a website called iOffer and it was about 30 pounds and I absolutely love it. Um, just got a really cute, aggressive little Rottweiler on it. So yeah, love that. Next thing I picked up was from Tab Sharp and it is this kind of 1980s inspired little vest. It says 1984 on it. It's got a little, what is that? A wolf. Um, yeah, just really liked it. Bit of a retro vibe, so that was really cool. And that was seven pounds from Topshop. Um, I picked up, sorry this is inside out because I've tried it on, it is, it's like a little, I guess, vest, very short dress but it's sheer, I don't know if you can see just how sheer it is, it was from H&M but the reason that I liked it is because it sort of ruches up at the bottom. So it's asymmetrical and I thought that was really cute. That was $14.99 from H&M. So love that. You guys remember the consignment store that I go to in the town where I live? Well, I picked up this. I, I think the only way that I can describe it is um, a waistcoat. Although that does make me quite unhappy saying that I own a waistcoat. Anyway, um, originally it was from Religion. It looks like this, it's quite long, and then it has this sort of distressed, um, ruched edging to it. And it's quite long for those of us that have a bit of junk in the trunk. Yeah, so um, yeah, like that. We'll rock that this summer, no doubt. Then I went to Select and I picked up this. Got a bit of a uh, retro vibe going on, but yeah, picked up this. It is a midi skirt, has a, this stonewashed denim thing going on, has a zip all the way down to the bottom, and it looks like that's quite high waisted, quite funky. Can rock that with a little pair of cons and maybe um, my Run DMC tee, something like that. Yeah, so that's that. So, I, I am going to apologise for the state of these. They're, they've been in the bag and they're really, really wrinkled. Um, but I picked these up from Forever 21, they're harem pants. Um, I own a few pairs of these and I just love them. I think you can dress them up, you can dress them down. And I haven't got a pair in this colour and as you've probably noticed that I do like plums. So yeah, pick these up. So they've got quite a big um, deep pocket there and then they ruche um, all the way down to the bottom and then they've got a tapered bottom there. Yeah. So, yeah, really like those, and they were, sorry, they were 12 75 and this skirt was £10, and the waistcoat was £8. Okay, so that's those. Then I got this. Um, I, I own so many leather, pleather biker jackets. I couldn't justify buying it in the black, which is what I'd originally seen, and... Um, my boyfriend bought it for me in cream. <laughs> so yeah, it looks like that, absolutely love it. It's really cropped. And then it's got this um, sort of really, really padded shoulders and then this mock croc distressed look on the arms and also on the back. It has rose gold hardware and I just like these details. Can you see it just has a little zip on the arm there and across there and I just thought it was really unusual and unique and I just love it. And that was from River Island and that was £60. So yeah, I'll be making lots of use out of that bad boy this year. Sorry, I've just dropped something. I'll be back in a sec. Sorry about that guys. Turns out I dropped my new blush but it's no biggie. I'll show you it in a second. The next thing that I picked up was this. It is just um, like a short t-shirt dress. 
it's quite tight um, I wouldn't wear it as a dress I'd probably rock some skinnies underneath it um, and a little crop leather jacket something like that and that was five pounds from Georgia Asda in the sale so bargain next thing I got from River Island was this basketball sports luxe inspired top and it has a 95 on it and then I don't know what that says New York is it and then this sort of floral rose pattern which I thought was really sweet and it's quite long but I just thought it was really nice colours for spring summer and it matches my new leather jacket so I might wear those together then I got this sexy little number from, where did I get this from? Miss Selfridge. And it is a faux leather, pleather, whatever you want to call it, little tank. And it is stretchy, which is quite nice if you've got a larger bust. So yeah, it looks like that. And then it has a little cord just across the booby bit there. And then these kind of triangular booby lady bits and uh, yeah really flattering on just thought it was really nice you know for a night out if you want to you know look a bit sexy so yeah love that and that was 18 pounds I'm rubbish at these prices um, and this top was 10 pounds in the sale at River Island and yes 18 pounds this was um, I also picked up in Forever 21, I should have organised my pile before showing you, but I just rubbish at stuff like that. Um, when I was in Liverpool, it was absolutely freezing, so I just needed something to keep me warm. So I picked up this, it's like a jersey material, but it's a bit biker jacket inspired, and it's black and it's fleece lined and it has this funnel neck and we were down on the Albert Dock and it just kept me really lovely and warm and that was about £13. I picked it up in Forever 21 in the sale so yeah that's very cute. Then I picked up this little denim jacket. I've wanted a little denim jacket for in black forever. Um, unfortunately it's not as black as I'd like it but I've just been on the search forever to find a denim jacket. Anyway, um, I picked this up. It was £17 from Select. I went to Superdrug and I picked up the MUA Luxe Velvet Lip Lacquer in Atomic. This is Atomic. It is bright, bright orangey red. The camera's not really picking it up, but this mother packs a punch. I also picked up a new uh, finishing brush, and I got this from TK Maxx. That was $4.99, if you can see. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna see how that works out for me. I picked up a few packets of these QVS lashes. Now, I have tried them before and I kind of like them, but they were on offer, so um, they were a pound each, so I picked up a few pairs that look like that. Also picked up these MUA eyeshadows. Now, I really love these. They're really, really pigmented. Sometimes I wet my brush um, just to get, you know, some really intense colour, but this one's slightly bluey colour and slightly green, but they're really pretty colours. So, yeah, pick those up, and they're a pound each. Bargain. So I love those. I picked up these Le Femme blushes as you can see that's what I dropped earlier so I've smashed one but um, one of the other youtubers recommended La Femme blushes and she absolutely swears by them so um, they had them in my local beauty store they were £1.69 and finally I picked up a new Eco Tools Sharpen and Smudge Brush. I've already got one of these. I love it just to smudge out a bit of a smoky eye. And um, yeah, that was on offer for like £2.50. So yeah, absolutely love that. And that, I think, concludes my haul. Um, yes, I didn't just go out and buy these things in one massive shopping trip. It's just stuff that I have picked up. Um, 
I hope that you like it. I hope that you subscribe to my channel, thumbs up and all that other good stuff. Again, any suggestions, comments down below. And I thank you for watching and I will see you guys in the next one. See you later. Mwah.